My grandmother actually was a teacher. And Marcus Freeman says it doesn't end there. My great uncle was a principal. I currently have two cousins in the district. We kind of call it the family business. At first, he didn't want to follow suit. I wanted to potentially own my own restaurant. And I also wanted to play professional football. But with a dad like Melvin Freeman. The sun is too hot to touch. Grab a star. Who could not be convinced? Marcus is a good young man. Not because he's my son. He's just a good person. A Phi Ed teacher for more than 30 years. His wife, an assistant superintendent. They guided their son. I did play in it professionally for just one year. My parents, after being released by the New York Giants, they had asked, hey, do you want to get a job? You know, I had just got cut, so I had some money in the bank. And I was like, no, I'm still going to try to train and, and, and get back into the NFL. And, and uh, they had talked about, how about you look into being a substitute teacher? So he got a license and subbed. And really just loved it. Now with a master's, Marcus is principal of Galtier Elementary. It's in the same school district his parents worked, St. Paul. I'm really trying to teach just being a lifelong learner, being able to take risks, being able to challenge yourself, and being okay with being wrong. I'm proud of what he has done, what he has achieved out of life so far, but I'm telling him not to stop. Get that PhD. The Freemans are also sharing a message with top leaders, as fewer than 1% of Minnesota teachers are black men. Go and get some more people of color. Kaya Edwards, CARE 11 News. Well, although Mr. Freeman's football career was cut short in that one year he played for the Giants, the team actually won the Super Bowl against the undefeated Patriots. He got a ring. That's awesome. He got a ring. Yeah. Hey, that's what counts. That's for a sure. memory you'll always have. All right, let's check in with our